Are you feeling lonely? Feeling like you don't got no one else to talk to? Chances are you probably don't. You have no friends. It's Avanti. And Tasia. And Makaya. And today we're going to be talking about fake relationships and friendships. <sighs> so today we are going to be talking about friendships first. And Tasia's going to be asking us questions. And I'm going to ask her the question because she can't ask herself the same question. Anyways. Okay. The first question is. This is stupid. What do you think is the weirdest thing that ever happened to you? In a friendship or relationship, Who's going that you this? had to cut them off. Mm. Cut it, cut it, cut it. Mine is my closest friend being weird towards me because they got a little bit of friends. Like I wasn't there, you know what I mean? Talk, talk, talk louder and speak it. Say with your chest. I said mine is. I had a friend. Um, it was just always me and her, and she got like five friends and start acting different and yeah had to cut her off so we gotta switch up okay switch up right. <laughs> more like wannabe what megan say i feel like for me it's more of like a growth thing like people aren't on the same mindset and i agree <laughs> um, i'm done it's definitely okay. a growth thing. Right. Makai, you can keep though? talking. Yeah, because... Because why is it growth? Um, people start to... I feel like people be on different paths in life. <laughs> and you really need to... If you're not with someone, like, someone's not doing what you do or, like, doing stuff that you don't like doing, you just can't surround yourself like that. Right. I 100% agree. I definitely agree with the growth. It doesn't just have to be beef or weirdness. Like, you can really just fall out because you guys don't have the same mindset or goals. Yeah. Like, why would I want to hang with you if you're a bum? Like, I don't know. Yeah. It's not pushing me or making me want to do better. But that's and that goes for relationships, too. Why would like, I want to hang with somebody you if you want to just go to West V every weekend <laughs> and chase bitches? Oh! <laughs> and chase girls, yeah. So it's like... <laughs> she saved you. Yeah. I agree because no, man, don't that's stop Joe, it. one, and two, what are you really out there for? This is for relationships, right? Yeah. Okay, relationships. Really? I mean, friendships, too. It's like. I have a toxic relationship. I think it's fun so to I'm go not out. Answering, not answering. <laughs> okay, she has a toxic relationship, but that's besides the point. So, <laughs> I think I agree for friendships, too. Like, um, it's cool to go out once in a while. But, like, if you have a friend that's, like, always getting drunk, like, every single weekend, I think that that's not my type of friend. And that's okay. But I'm just saying, like, I do like to get turned. I'm not going to lie. But it's only, like, But there's other ways to have fun. Right? You can have fun with your friends. You don't have to, like, just resort to alcohol and drugs. And if you think, and if you, like, are the type of person to only use me for that. You could go to the movies and watch that Bob Marley movie. (laughs) Yeah. <laughs> what my guy? Anyways, <laughs> next Sorry. question. I want to go see it. That's why. Um, Me too. Okay. Next question. Is this like a relationship question? It can be any. All right. What type of relationship do you like? Uh, do you like want yourself and like you know? Go, my guy. I want someone that I could trust. Yeah, and I. If you can't trust, there's no trust. There's no relationship without trust. trust. Yeah, Yeah, I was about to say, you can't trust them. There ain't even a relationship. I'm saying, I want somebody more protective and rich. That's my. That's my next. That's my next goal. Real go getter. (laughs) Right. (laughs) So, so no, I like somebody who doesn't do the bare minimum and goes out their way. Y'all might say our podcast is boring, but we have. The best questions are at the end, so keep watching. Right, just keep <laughs> listening. All this right. Could you ask a question again? Um, <laughs> do you guys feel like relationships and friendships are similar? Like they should be treated kind of the same or? Yeah. Well, it just depends. I feel like if you're cutting, if you're quick to cut your friend off, you should be quick to cut your man off. Like if for the same like standard you should hold them to the same accountability like it's different i feel like you can give your man like a couple chances but make sure you're giving your friend that too 
Like, I wouldn't just be quick to like, cut your friend off, but it is different because as a friend, you know what you know what you're doing and your intentions. So well, if it's some I, in a weird relationship shit, like, too, yeah. I feel like it's the same too. Like yeah. you know what you're doing. You know when if you wouldn't do it in front of them, why not? Right. Why do it when they're not there? Right. But I feel like if you're just letting some guy walk all over you and you're quick to cut your friends off, then you're the problem. That is horrible. But okay, that was this? our. That was our talk about friendships and relationships. See y'all later. Have a good day. Bye. Can we redo this?